old dairy was a 12 swing over, herringbone. This dairy's been here for probably 30 years. I was getting a little bit tired of milking cows. I'd sort of had enough of milking cows morning and night. Lately, had robots that suit my style of farming, so with a lot of deliberation, I decided to put the Laley robots in, just to um, lighten the load a little bit. We are Peter and Larissa Joyce. We milk 140 cows on 220 acres. We have a pasture-based system, about 40 paddocks, and the cows rotate through the 40 paddocks on A and B grazing. The pasture base is a really good system for the robots. It seems to work really well. The cows come and go as they please. They, get, they come home, get milked, and then they go to a fresh paddock um, after every milking. So they, they, they do really well on pasture-based system. Because I only need two robots, I, we could retrofit in the old dairy, so we stripped the dairy out and with Laley we retrofitted the two A5s on either side of, of the pit. So the cows transitioned really well into the robots because they were coming in the same spot where they used to come in. Before we had the robots, um, I came down and just yeah, helped out with milkings and got cows. On a monthly basis or every two months, I used to come down to help Peter her test. Since having the A5 robots, um, he's able to access that data now on a daily basis when the cow comes in. So that eliminates me coming down to her test with him. Favourite features would be the information that the, the robots give you. I can do it on my phone. I generally go into the office and just look at the screen. It gives me all the information that I need. I just scroll through it and they tell you pretty much everything you want to know, whether it's heat detection, protein, uh, mastitis, liters. I peaked at 30 and a half liters, where normally I'd peak at about 27 liters in spring. So I would have thought that milk production was up probably about three liters, three to three and a half liters per cow per day over the springtime, which is significant. Um, improvement and, and that was mainly due to cows probably being a bit more relaxed and coming and going as they please. I'm saving in a few areas. Definitely the, the big one is grain. The old style, every cow would get say seven kilos a day or eight kilos a day, but with the new Laley robots, they're fed to production. Say so the cows are producing 40 litres, they will get eight kilos of grain but the cows that are only producing 20 litres, they only get four kilos of grain. So there's a, definitely a saving there. And another saving would be uh, teat dip. Definitely don't use as much teat dip. Workload has changed. Where I used to get up every morning at five o'clock, now I get up when I wake up. I'll just come down when I'm ready. I'll come down and I'll wash the shed out, wash the yard out, make sure all the cows are coming through nicely. So the workload has definitely um, eased a lot. It's a lot easier on the legs. I was getting really sore legs, sore feet from milking for so many years. Not milking them anymore, I'm just doing other things around the farm. So it's, it's definitely a lot more enjoyable. It's a lot more easier on, on, the, on the physical aspect of milking cows. Lifetime's definitely changed, family lifestyle. Peter gets more time with us. Having the A5 robots has allowed Peter to go back to coaching football with the juniors. Um, and our son, so it's really good because it frees him up from not having to be here every morning and here every night milking the cows. I wasn't keen on milking cows for another 10 or 15 years. If, if I didn't put the robots in, I would have probably got out of dairying, I would have probably just gone into beef. So it, it's definitely kept me in dairying for, um, for a number of years more.